Hello friends, this is Sam McClure with the Adoption Law Firm. It's April 8th, 2020, and we are in the middle of this crazy coronavirus pandemic. And I thought it may be interesting to explain a little bit about how the coronavirus is changing court cases, changing the court system, changing the legal environment. And so one of the biggest changes is that all unnecessary, all non-emergency hearings have either been postponed or uh, gone to video. So for example, two weeks ago, I did my first adoption hearing through a Zoom meeting. It was really interesting. I was on one camera, the judge was on another camera, and the wife uh, was on a different camera, and she was in quarantine because of the coronavirus, and the husband and the child were on a different camera, and uh, the judge finalized the adoption, took all the testimony that needed to be taken uh, through a Zoom meeting. Uh, pretty fascinating. Uh, another thing that has changed is uh, most of Alabama is on an electronic filing system, except the probate courts where adoption happens. Uh, usually those have to be uh, hand-delivered or mailed in. Now we mail in all of our pleadings. Um, also, another thing that's changed, it's interesting, the governor has ordered that documents can be notarized uh, via video conference uh, if you're an attorney or work for an attorney. So uh, if you're working with me on an adoption and there's documents that need to be notarized, all I need to do is email those to you. You print them out, I watch you sign them, and then you mail them back to me and I notarize them. And so uh, broader, in more broader terms, things like the federal courts have uh, gone to uh, video conferencing. Uh, TPR hearings, I think, for the most part, are being postponed. And so this is having a big impact on foster care and adoption in Alabama, but we're still moving forward. I think uh, a lot of courts are at half staff, half personnel. Half the staff comes one day. The other staff comes the next day. I know this is what uh, the Alabama Department of Public Health is doing in issuing birth certificates. So a lot of things are slowing down tremendously, uh, but we're still moving forward. Uh, if you're considering adoption, don't think that this is the time not to do it because things are still moving forward. We'd love to help you with the process.